Hey, Shovelhead 8. Uh, welcome to another Cast Iron Wednesday. Uh, Spin, I gotta go collect something here. I have to get my one little helper. The other two just showed up here. Oh, they're in frame. Anyways, being as this is cast iron wind tape, and it's also spam timber, we're going to do a collaboration, competition, whatever, head to head spam. And these are Kentucky pancake cornbread. They're uh, savory. So, anyways, we're just going to give them a try. First things first, out comes the spam. There we go. Uh, oh, it smells so good. It's bacon spam this time because that's uh, the head in the store. I'm going to cut about half of it into. I'm going to cut it into four slices because I don't think I could eat six. And there we go. So our pan's heating up for that. And we'll get that in a minute. So our ingredients for our cornbread, our, our corn pancakes, are a cup of cornmeal, a cup of all-purpose flour, uh, one and a half teaspoons of baking powder, three quarters of a teaspoon of baking soda, and a teaspoon of salt. And that's it for for our dries. Give it a little stir. Now for our wet ingredients. This is supposed to be buttermilk, but it's not. It's uh, yogurt. Cream. And an egg and a quarter cup of water. And they say you may have to have extra water. Yogurt and buttermilk are pretty well uh, interchangeable, so we'll get that in here. The recipe says to mix it up with a mixer, but they're too noisy. Looks like we're going to need more water. Because we want like a pancake or griddle cake consistency. And that looks pretty good. This is supposed to make uh, six griddle cakes so we're going to switch shots there it is all mixed up and maybe a little bit more water so by the time we get there okay so we're going to switch shots. In goes our spam, bacon flavored. And I think we'll turn that down a bit. And we're going to get some oil on this grizzle grizzle griddle.
Okay, the original recipe says that these are to be eaten. You can eat these are savory to be eaten like cornbread as an accompaniment with your meal. So we'll get the first one on and we'll come back. I think we'll send them out. Anyways, we'll come back. And temptation strikes. I'm going to have to have a slice. Oh, it looks like I got helpers. So everybody got some. Okay, we're flipping these over. I guess there's going to be two batches. They turn a nice brown. And we'll come back when we're done. Okay, we're going to take this plate full off. Because we've got another batch to do. And you can see that they sure look good. So I'm going to get these off and we'll come back when the second batch is done. Okay, we're going to get started on our plate. We're going to take four of these corn cakes and we're going to put on a couple of pieces of Spam. And then we're going to move our to our other... Here's our plate. We're going to put some butter on them because the recipe calls for that. It's margarine, but it's close. And like I say, these are supposed to be savory grilled cakes like corn bread. But being as this is Canada and they're round and they're cooked in a pan, guess what? They're pancakes. They're getting served. And now's the time for the DIY dark matter taste test. So we'll go down to the pit and take a look. And how's that for a picture? My little helpers are, are here. So anyways, it's time for the DIY dark matter taste test. So. First one's first. And now it's my turn. Let's do Mr. Timmy sneaks down to find something. Yes. They're actually quite good. Like they're they're a little bit gritty like, like cornbread is, but that's what they are. And uh, with syrup, butter and syrup, they're pretty good. And of course we can't forget spam timber, so here's my contribution, and it's not much. Oh man, I love that taste. Anyways, this is Shovelhead 8. Uh, thank you for watching Castor on Wednesday uh, Spam Timber Special. Please search for other channels doing Castor on Wednesday and Spam Timber. And uh, I'll see you next week.